I'm not going to pretend something isn't feeling scary for me or I'm apprehensive about something, but I'm not going to let it stop me. Hey, hey, it's Christine Horn, and welcome back to another Motivation Monday with the Hollywood Bound Actor Podcast. I am sending you such great energy for a week ahead, a, a positive week ahead. I'm so excited. I can't even get it out. Oh my goodness. You know, I made a post on my Instagram page. And if you're not following me, you totally should. Actress Christine Horn, come on and follow me on Instagram because there's a lot of fun stuff there. But I made a post last week or recently rather, where I was asking people like if money or your job wasn't an issue, what was really holding you back from your dream? And some of the answers were interesting. Some people were like, absolutely nothing. Nothing's holding me back. I'm ready to go right now. All I need is opportunity. But then there were still some comments that were talking about procrastination because of fear of failure, procrastination because of fear of success. And you know, that's the toughest one to read and not saying I can't relate, not saying I cannot relate like I can, but I will also want to tell you that I know what it's like to be on both sides of that coin and what it means to come out from that. There are definitely places that are new to me, like new things, new ideas that can be scary. Yes. And, but what I want you to think about today, if, if this is coming up for you, if procrastination is coming up because of fear of failure or fear of success, and I know I talk a lot about that on this podcast, but if that is what's coming up for you, I want you to just start to really envision yourself on the other side of it. What would you look like on the other side of it? What would you look like if you took the scary, using air quotes here, what would happen if you took the scary step? I have a saying, that, and I'm not saying it's mine, but I say it often, especially to my students and to myself, I say, feel the fear and do it anyway. So that means I don't, I'm not going to pretend something isn't feeling scary for me or I'm apprehensive about something, but I'm not going to let it stop me. You know, when I was putting together my, my live event booking magnet live, um, be sure you, you know, put a pin in it for July, 2022, by the way. But when I was planning the first one, I had so much fear coming up. So my, my inner critic, my limiting beliefs were talking loud in my ear every day. If you're new to me, my inner critic, I, I gave her a name. Her name is Veronica. So Veronica was loud, honey, all in my ear talking about what couldn't happen and what I was not qualified to do. Oh, nobody was going to show up like all the BS. And I told my husband, I said, babe, I said, ooh, Veronica is loud today. That must mean I'm doing something amazing. And I just told him, I said, I'm gonna just take a scary step today. I'm just gonna take the scary step. I'm scared, I feel fear, but I'm gonna take a scary step because I know on the other side of this is the vision that's in my head. I wouldn't have even had this idea if there wasn't another side to this. And so I say the same thing to you. No matter what it is, I mean, I know we, this is about acting, so I'm gonna just lean into that because I know many of you have day jobs and night jobs and responsibilities, and it can often feel like this thing will never happen. And what's the point in all this energy? But let me tell you something, if it is in you, if the dream is in you, keep going for it. And I don't care how small it is that you're going toward it. Let's say you never quit your day job, right? but you still get to perform in some way. You write your own stories. You put your own videos on social media. You still get to be an artist. And I think that's the main thing I just wanna pour into you today. Feel the fear, do it anyway, take a scary step. No one's saying it's not gonna feel scary. I would be lying to you if I said that. But also understand when fear comes up, whether it's fear of success or fear of failure, it's because something's there. Otherwise you wouldn't have, you would just be comfortable. You'd just be chilling. Like, no, something is there. And it's something that's meant for you to birth and to see through. And it doesn't mean that you see it through as big as I do, but you get to see it through on your terms. So I wanna leave you with that today as you go through this week. I want you to call forth all that you desire, speak life into yourself and onto others and stay encouraged and really start to ask yourself, okay, fear of failure, okay? I have fear of success, of what? Really start to get clear. That way we just don't, we don't leave it in this kind of vague area of fear of failure. Failure of what? What is What in your mind do you think is gonna be the worst thing that can happen? Who is it that you're concerned about specifically? 
Is it a friend, a family? Is it just strangers? Like get really specific because if we don't really start to dig deeper into this, we can't get on the other side of it. So we can talk more about this another time. But again, make sure you follow me on Instagram at actress Christine Horn. I've also been playing on TikTok lately, really having fun expressing myself creatively, uh, which was a block I had to get over. And I'm still working through that. You know, uh, the teacher teaches themselves, right? So it's going to be an amazing week. I already feel it. There's just good things happening right now. Just there are people, there are phone calls, there are emails being written about you right now for your good. And I want you to just claim that, hold on to that and be a blessing to someone else today. Make someone else smile, give someone else uh, some information, share something good with someone else because all that just keeps coming back to you. All right. I'm Christine Horn, the booking magnet. And hey, Oh, don't forget, if you don't have your own booking magnet t-shirt or mug or, you know, merchandise, come on over to our shop at shophba.com. That way you can get your swag on with me and you can take a picture and tag me online. <laughs> All right. I'll see you next week. Bye.